Now time to unbox some cookies from New Moon Kitchen. Yes, finally and at last. No, the box did not come looking this dirty. I ripped off the logo, but before I ripped off the logo, the box was sprayed. And some of the ink ran a bit. So no, it is not New Moon Kitchen that shipped this box this dirty. Just in case anybody would be like, what? Not so sloppy the box is. Well, it's true that sometimes if it's like rainy or whatever, it can cause the box to look a bit messy, but no, it wasn't done. Cut into that. Do I see my name there? I think I possibly might, so I'm gonna actually have to slide this out of the way once I finish slicing it. And yes, my name was right there with a thank you, and they gave me one bite me cookie box. Hmm, wait, no, that's because I ordered that. I thought that was a bonus, but no, that wasn't a bonus. I mean, it would have been cool if it were a bonus. But. Oh, would you look at that? Well, isn't this cute? Polka dots. Oh yes, oh yes, oh yes. It has been a long time since I've had these. It's great to have them once again. Now if you're wondering why haven't I boxed these in a long time, well that's because I'd usually order them from Well. Because it's Well, I get some other stuff alongside them. But for some reason Well stopped carrying them, so I decided to just order them directly from the manufacturers. And that's all that's inside of this box. Before I conclude the video, I'm going to take a look at the expiry date. The fact that this was made and printed in Canada, eh? Yes! As you can see, these are not the healthiest things on the planet, but at least the ingredients list isn't worrisome. And here's the bite me. Ingredients there. Expiry date's there. And that does it for this video.